So, th this movie. The Boss Baby is another freaking DreamWorks movie that came out this year. And oh my goodness. The Boss Baby. Let me talk about the freaking plot of this movie. A new baby's arrival impacts a family told from the point of view of a delightfully unreliable narrator. A wildly imaginary seven-year-old boy named Tim. The most unusual boss baby arrives at Tim's home in a taxi wearing a suit and carrying a briefcase. In the instant, sibling rivalry must team up with him and the dog in order for, him to, for them to talk about each other in order to do what he's supposed to do in the sequel war between babies and puppies. <sighs> Hashtag this movie freaking sucked. The bye I mean boss baby I almost said bye bye man. This movie freaking sucked. The boss baby is the second handed worst movie of two, the third worst movie of 2017. Yes, it is worse than Transformers The Last Night, but it is nowhere near as worse as The Bye Bye Man. This movie was horrendous. It was embarrassing. A talking baby with a brief suit, ca with a briefcase, and wearing a suit and tie. What the heck? <sighs> People give trolls a lot of crap, but I love trolls. I thought that was a was an awesome DreamWorks animation move from last year, to tell the truth. And I love Captain Underpants, but this movie, this movie was not funny. It was not. <laughs> Stopping the fight between babies and puppies is interesting, right? But the movie is done. <laughs> this movie is just... Uh, there's poop jokes all around. Look. I know it's called the Boss Baby, but you don't need all these freaking poop jokes. Uh, it just makes it so uncomfortable to watch at times. The animation looks nice. I will give it that. The animation looks nice. I will say for... It better look nice for a $125 million budget. And from DreamWorks or Pixar, it, your animation better be nice. It better be nice. And the Emoji Movie is getting bad reviews. And I'm not even seeing that movie. But this was wor This is worse. Acting in this movie is fine. Jimmy Kimmel, Lisa Kudrow from Friends, Alec Baldwin, he's fine as the baby. Toby Maguire, the original Spider-Man, is the best part of this movie. Toby freaking Maguire, the original Peter Parker and Spider-Man from the Sam Raimi trilogy, is the best part of this movie. It just... This movie was not even interesting. It was so uncomfortable to watch. And now the fact this movie made $495 million worldwide and this movie's getting a sequel is beyond me. And just... I'm just... The soundtrack is fine. But the jokes are terrible. I don't know who it is, but... There's so many poop jokes that I wanted to curse as I was watching the movie. I know a lot of people like, some people like this movie and that's f fine, but I don't like this movie. The Bi Boss Baby, don't waste your time. I'm not, I'm not spending a whole hour on this because I have other videos I have to record. But stay away from The Boss Baby, okay? If you have not seen The Boss Baby, don't watch it. Stay away from it. It's not worth your time. This movie didn't make me mad as much as the Bye Bye Man or Transformers 5 did. But this movie still irritated me. 
I'm giving the boss baby a skip it. Let me know what you guys think about this movie down below. Do you like it? Do you hate it? If you somewhat like this movie, I want to know why. But let me know what you guys think. And if you like this, you can click here and we can all have a good time.